if you notice, uh, if you notice, there's no in this group actually. I've already checked. There's no big can liners. There's tons and tons of small liners. No big can liners. And this is our our janitorial cart. No big can liners. These I bought myself. This is what I'm going to use. This is what Kroger would never buy for their own janitors. They're going to buy wimpy little thin can liners. And this is what they've got to work with with the trash. This is what I found in one of the trash cans that we were that I was having to process. And I'll show you what's inside of this. Heavy pieces of metal. And they just stuffed it in the trash can, didn't even care about it. Didn't even bother to think whether or not we'd actually be able to bag it. They cared more about what they were doing in their job to care about the person who's going to have to put out the trash. This is not only in the store, this is out of the store. This is what the customers do. They take their, their uh, drinks and they throw their drinks into the trash kit bag. You know, they full. You know, they don't even bother to empty them or they could empty them very easily on the street and just throw them in the trash bag. But they throw them in with stuff. And then the janitors have to deal with this, and it is, it it really is a is a um, it really hurts their their confidence, and it hurts their pride and everything to have to deal with this crap every day. And then people say, well, you know, if they had only gotten better educated, they wouldn't have this job. Yeah, well, that's like most of America right now is most of you guys are junior high, high school dropouts. You never went to college. I went to college and I'm still dealing with this crap, okay? So you don't treat people like this.